Nighthawk Gold in the news today. Nighthawk trades as NHK in the Toronto Stock Exchange and MIMZF and the OTCQX in the States as they report more positive metallurgy from Colomac. With me now to break it down here, Dr. Michael Byron. Hey, Doc, appreciate the time and update here. As always, more positive results here. Uh, nice metallurgy for Colomac. Why don't you run through today's news for investors? Yeah, thanks, Rob. Um, yeah, today we, we put out a release um, that these are the, the results from our 2019 uh, metallurgical sampling at Colmac. We took four bulk drill core samples and submitted submitted them for a SAG design. So that's the milling, right? And uh, gravity concentration, flotation, uh, bottle roll, heat bleach testing, and so on and so forth. This is what we've done with every um, uh, sampling that we've done uh, to date. So uh, we've done four metallurgical test programs to, uh, to date, so 2016, 17, and 18, and now 19, uh, involving 12 bulk samples. Um, so I guess the, the and, and in this release, we put out not only the 2019 results, but in the tables, we put everything out, right? Uh, all four uh, studies we've done to date. So, so it really shows the consistency um, um, that we're, we're seeing in terms of not only the hardness of the rock, which is important, right? Because you don't want to, It'd be hard to design a mill if you're dealing with all these different variable, various hardnesses in your ore. So Colmax very consistent no matter where you are, along strike or at depth and so on and so forth. And uh, the recoveries, so we're getting uh, strong recoveries in, in, in any process. So we're at the point now with this that uh, we don't have to do any more uh, sampling on the Colmax hill until we decide which process is going to be the lead process. And when you do that, then then you can do some real detailed studies. So, you know, we've uh, we've got you know today we've got to the point where we wanted to go uh, to understand uh, how the Colmac rock behaves, and now it's at the stage where uh, when we start doing more engineering studies, we pick a process that that uh, makes the best sense for Colmac, and then you can really optimize your your uh, your studies, whether it's uh, heat bleach or or uh, whether we're dealing with uh, cyanide systems and, and so on and so forth. So that's where we are today. I think, uh, you know, we don't need to go into the ins and outs of, of uh, each of the, the studies, uh, but I think uh, what, we, what we have shown over these four uh, um, test programs to date is that uh, Colmac Rock behaves very well and responds well to all um, the different process routes, right? So uh, we're, we're in a good place. What's next up here, Doc? Uh, next, well, we're we're queuing up to get some drill results out. Uh, uh, you know, so that that's going to be our next release. Um, we've drilled to date, uh, put thirty three holes in. We're just uh, above sixteen thousand meters of our twenty five thousand. So we're getting that critical mass of of uh, results back from the lab. So shortly, we should start pumping out. Uh, news releases on on uh, the work that we've done this year. So that that would be uh, drilling at Colmac as well as drilling at Treasure Island that we'll that we'll shortly put out here. Appreciate that update, Dr. Michael Byron, CEO Nighthawk Gold, NHK on the Toronto Stock Exchange, MIMZF OTCQX in the states. Hey, Doc, appreciate that update. Certainly look forward to checking back in when you have some more news to report. Perfect. Thanks, Rob. Have a great day.